the similarities between between you and Trish are so pronounced. You know, you both you both essentially come in with one role as as that kind of eye candy model role, but both of you put so much grit and determination into actually um, you know, being great performance in the ring. Like what did you learn from Trish? Because I guess she was a few years ahead of you on that journey by the time you came in. Yeah, the main thing I really learned was um like I said, she made it look easy and I, I didn't give her quite the respect that she may have deserved for being there before me and everything, all the work that she had put in. And so once I got in there, I was like, oh, I, I, I'm not telling this story right or I'm not doing this right. I was so concerned with just learning a move or just learning to bump, like the very basics of it, I was so concerned with. And then it just made me respect her more because she was very welcoming. She was very um, eager to be a leader and kind to let you know, okay, you know, you got to shift this or try this. And so learning all of that, that was really like, okay, to me, that is where respect is earned, not just because she's been there, but she became a leader and where she is today and how she continues her legacy and to evolve, like we've been talking about. Um, you look at her and you're like, wow. Wow, like that is incredible what she's still able to do yeah. 20 years later. Right. Yep. Um, and so I think I just attribute like real leaders, um, you know, they care about other people in the business and they earn that respect and she did that. And so it made me just respect her that much more. Yeah, I mean, the run that she's just had last year, just incredible. Yeah. Like best work for career 20, 20 plus years on amazing. Totally. And I think she looks better than ever you know so like just everything from physical to mental to spiritual the way she's showing up um, it's just a testament to her hard work behind closed doors like because you can see other people 20 years later not doing that right mm -hmm. and so it yeah. takes a lot of hard work and consistency to be able to show up like that 20 years later and also reinvention i mean that for the yeah. ability of her to come out and complete bring that heel character to life like we've seen that with with um christian cage in AEW recently being able to completely the easiest thing in the world would just be to be a fan favorite and ride the nostalgia act and come out to the same music and do what you did 20 yeah. years ago but i think i think real bravery comes with saying no i'm gonna i'm gonna finish this my career off with a yeah. different chapter yeah yeah yeah. And also, I just want to acknowledge that it's not real easy to 20 years later, come back and do the same music in no, the same no. room. Um, you know, people think, oh, it would be easy, but it, it actually isn't. Um, you build up, even just physically, you build up a callus when you're doing it week after week after week. And it's funny, I was just um, surfing behind a boat and I fell and ironically, it looked like a bump. It was it was really funny. It's just my natural reaction to <laughs> fall still came out like I'm taking a bump in the water. And the next day I was like, oh, my neck hurts. And yeah. I mean, that's whiplash in water. And I was like, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. I was like, yeah. you, you kind of get that itch. Like you want to be back in the ring or just be called back for a match. Um, and although I think that would be awesome that I'm like, Ooh, can I handle that? <laughs> yeah. So when you see somebody come back 20 years later, it's because of their consistency that they're able to come back that way. And then to top it off of like, I'm going to be even better. It's like, that's really a testament to the hard work. Yeah. And I'm glad you clarified that because I think what I meant by, by easy as in, in the fans eyes, just yeah. return, return from a character standpoint, like return into the old yeah. catchphrases, the old familiarity things, as opposed to, to, but I completely get your point. I mean, it's incredible that people can come back after 10 years away from the ring or even longer yeah. and still and still go because I know that I mean they talk a lot about ring rust but it is the grind isn't it you've got to just keep doing it and keep doing it yeah. and it must be so hard when you have a have a time away from it well and I think that's the beauty of when somebody also comes back and when a fan can just be dropped back into that space 10 or 20 years ago with their music or their look or their moves um because it's just showing like just bringing that energy back, even after 10 years and 20 years, mm. you know, we're, we're humans too. And we go through life too. So to come out and just have that connection again, it's, it's awesome for the superstars and for the fans. And I think it's just great when I get to see that on TV.